Driven by anxiety, Samus sets out for the main sector. Along the way, she encounters a lone Federation soldier who is en route to Sector 1. Samus tails the soldier and finally arrives at the Bioweapon Research Center deep in Sector 1, where she encounters the mysterious woman again, shown here. The woman identifies herself as the person in charge of the, of the facility, Madeline Bergman, and divulges all of the secrets of the operation there. Oh, she's a songbird. Madeline claims that Samus herself had been the key to recreating the Metroids, and that person who first ordered the weaponization of Metroids in the project was Adam, shown here. Samus sets out for Sector Zero to destroy the Metroids and the AI that controls them, MB. Welcome back to Metroid Other M. We're gonna have a time today, you and I and Nisko. I had a joke prepared for last time, thinking, oh, I can't remember Madeline's name. I hope it starts with a B. Cool, she's Mother Brain, awesome. Anyway. What makes you think that? Because her initials and the fact that this is hack writing. She created Mother Brain. I guess you're right. I mean, that would be kind of... It's stupid! Yeah, that would be dumb. I don't, I don't think they'd go that far, though. I mean... Have you gotten that far yet? Well, well, uh, no, but... I got a funny feeling we're gonna be, uh... Whoever the deleter is just killed the creator of Mother Brain. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll cross the bridge when we come to it. Again, uh, tunnel vision. Uh, I don't think you heard me last time. Uh, there's fucking Metroids! On board? Oh, those are old hat though. That's like saying, oh, oh yeah, we have some some active and uh, beeping nuclear weapons in our in, in in the base right now. It's like, yeah, we should um, we, uh, beeping. You said, uh, let's let's take care of that immediately. There's Metroids here. Let's take care of that immediately. That's the that's the equivalent of, do you know why kids love cinnamon toast crunch? Is like, did you know the Met Federation likes creating Metroids? It's like no shit at this point. It's the cinnamon sugar swirls in every Metroid. It, oh, and that's delicious. I mean, I don't know. I don't. I don't eat Metroids. I don't know what they taste like. I'm kind of thirsty. Ow! Stop! Ow! Ow! Stop! Wow! Get just off. get rid of an E tank, why don't you? Good lord! Yeah, it's nice. It's real nice. I hate you guys. You guys stink. I hate you. Brand new weapon to test out your new plasma beam as you get bodied. The screw attack doesn't really work so well on these guys, though. Well, they got big old, big old shields. Big yeah, old, uh, the carapaces doesn't, uh, doesn't do much. I got to do it the old-fashioned way. So, yeah, not everything works against screw attack, but a lot of things do, which is great. Makes traversal a cakewalk. All right. Uh... Anyway, good job, Samus, for not bringing the scientist, and now she's gone. That's great. Oh, well, she would have been a liability. I don't know. She did forget about the deleter. God, now that now that I'm saying all this out loud, this Samus is a doofus. Yeah. Like such obvious things are being overlooked. No, what the fuck? What? Hello. This guy again? Hi. But I killed you already, man. Glad they're making super bugs. I hate it here. It sucks here. <laughs> As it just shoots a bunch of missiles straight into your yeah. face. I don't like it here. Just get the hell. I mean, I, 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 I've shot this thing in the face like 18 trillion times. I mean, I right, take a missile to the. There we go. Did that do it? All right, almost. I mean, that hurt a lot, I guess. I mean, why are you even here? What's your point? What? Oh, you're, and he's dead. What? Power bomb. Delicious fruit. Uh. Oh. Health. It's a power-up. It's the Seeker Missile. Right! I'm sorry. Hold on a second. So, um... But, hold on just a, just a second here. So the Metroids are in Sector Zero. Uh-huh. And uh, to get to Sector Zero, we have to use the Seeker Missile. So it's a good thing that we got the key on the way there. No. We killed the thing. Now it's dead, because we got the Seeker Missile. That's how he was able to seek us out all this time. You see? You see? You see? What no, that? now we can shoot a bunch of missiles. Yeah. That's and, stupid. And also, Adam didn't authorize it, so therefore we are just being a little jerk. Oh, uh, well, what, whatever Adam wants, I don't give a shit right now. But, but Dad. Metroids! But Dad. Metroids! But Dad. Metroids! Metroids. If Dad says Metroids, Metroids. are okay, then we, ha they we can are, have Metroids. They are not okay! 
Daddy Adam said I could have a pet Metroid. Yeah, but my real daddy says I can't because they're bad and evil. I don't have a dad. You know, Ravenbeak would have said okay to Metroids. Well, I don't care what Ravenbeak said. <laughs> I says no Metroids. Yeah, seriously, both of your dads suck. <laughs> Samus. It's like my quiet beak dad who said no Metroids. <laughs> quiet row, man. Quiet row. He Quiet know, he, he Grandpa knows what's best for me. Both of my dads are terrible. All right. Sector Zero. Oh man, is there a crossfix of Ravenbeak and Adam Malkovich? Why would Dad v Dad? Huh. But they all live as a family. Samus lives in a household with two dads. All right, so we need a super missile for this part right here. Boosh. Ooh, you even got some splatter on your visor. That was pretty cool. Reminds me of Metroid Prime. Uh, uh mm-hmm. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? It does. All right, so, uh, you remember in that one episode where we basically had to do a big, gigantic loop around? Yeah. We got the speed booster. We're basically going that route again, because that's where Sector Zero is. Okay. It's a couple of uh, pickups along the way, too. I believe it is time for an update. Oh, an update? Yeah. All right, it's episode 10, so I it's episode 10. To, to tell what my score is. And we've actually had some pretty cool moments and a lot of fucking stupid moments. We, we, have, in, we have indeed. So, what's your score? Because mine's sitting at a pretty 7.5, man. Well, uh, for what is to come, I have boiled everything down from you know, my Metroid bias to my just playing this bias. Everything, everything, I give a 6 out of 10. That thing's dead now, by the way. Nice! Yeah. Every, a after considering everything, I'm giving it a 6 out of 10. A generous 6 out of 10. I think it went down. Mm-hmm. Huh. It stands at a 6. Because of what we're doing today. Well, we haven't gotten there yet. Yep, but we're gonna get there, and uh, well, I'm asking up up to this point. Up until this point is the is the end of episode ten, and having known having known what I know, okay, okay, it is a six. It is it is a it is a uh, a, a metric I am comfortable giving you. <laughs> it is it is accurate. It is up to date. No, it'll, it'll be good. It'll, it'll be fine. Uh huh. The fact that your score went down, and you know what's happening here soon. Uh, leads me to believe that things are about to get just a tad stupider. Yep. Glasses are off. They are indeed going to get Super a Super missile stupider. right here. We're about to get into some really bonkers territory. I well, can't wait. All right, now we're getting into a bit of back of uh, backtracking territory. Oh, okay. And one of the best parts of Metroid Prime 1, at least, was going back through old areas with all your new toys and just wreaking havoc. <laughs> going through here with the screw attack is very nice. <laughs> What perfect timing! Most cause, of, cause havoc. <laughs> see, most of the dangers though are gone now, but there's still some enemies, and it's just nice to just 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 run right on through. Like, oh, excuse hi. me. <laughs> okay, that's pretty great. You, you get a, can't you at least tack on a point one for that one? It's 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 just natural catharsis, is what it is. Yeah, that's right. And that and that is what contributes a lot to the sixes, and that's that's like what keeps it from being a five point five. What would this game have to do to get a zero out of you? Crash, bad frame rate, unplayable. Uh, uh, so, so just game fuck ups. Uh, anime cry with Samus. <laughs> God damn! I can't wait for that to happen. The narrative would have to be way worse. Um, it would have to look worse. Like if it got rid of the deleter subplot, that would ruin some points for me. If it. Uh, Completely negates Prime's place in the in the in the timeline. Instead yeah, that of, that would be a big oof. Yeah, that that, that would be that'd be a big zero. Um, not being you, you, you could make this game so much worse. You you really could. I mean, they've already bastardized a character that barely had like she had personality, but she never spoke. So you could kind of put your own thoughts it's, onto her like that. That's basically what we've been doing in these entire series because she's never said a word until Dread. So we were able to give her like, like she was listening to her MP3 player in her in her helmet for most of the series. But why is it in Metroid Dread? I cared so much about what she was thinking, what was going on. Because she spoke once, 
twice. Twice? Wait, twice? You want to call that a, uh, you want to call screaming us a, uh, nah, that's a not speech talking. line. That's just, that's just <laughs> yelling. <laughs> but I think it's because, you know, Samus goes against character to show how much character she has. That's pretty nice. And that's what I'm saying. She had a personality with not uttering a single word. Yeah, and they, they try to refine that personality by giving her personality to say how much her personality is. It's, 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 it just doesn't work. All right, here is the infamous Shine Spark puzzle. You gotta build up and then kind of jump at this divot right here. You kind of go forward, and there's a missile expansion. Oh, ew. But you're not done. Now you have to carefully jump over the hole here. But I'm not done yet. And there's a metro, I mean a second missile expansion. Oh my. That's kind of neat. So I, I, did a, I did a great first try, you know, go me. Good you know, job, that was, good job. That was, that was very, very skilled on my part. We might, we might be back here, I don't know. Maybe there might be something else there, but it takes some time. But for right now, we did that and that's good. Can't super missile that fan or is it not there's worth no, it? There's nothing there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, we, yeah, we got everything. We did, it, we did it perfectly first time. That was... Kudos. That was well done. All right. That just added a point one to your score. Yeah, it's still six. Still six. Uh, you, you know what would actually give this a zero score, I bet you anything? What? If you had the personality of Dark Side Phil. <laughs> where, if the game wasn't holding your hand, automatic terrible game. And there's what the Seeker Missile does. Same thing as Prime 2? I think it kind of works better here, because, you know, it, it locks on and there's they're close enough together mm. that if you if the game recognizes you're using a Seeker Missile, it's like, oh, okay, we'll give it to you. Oh dear. And the gravity's been turned upside down. Who is messing with the gravity? Okay, that's awesome. Who is messing with the gravity? Gravity puzzles, we love to see it. So this is neat, because you've been just using the, the screw attack on your way through here, backtrack, and you yeah. think you think you know how it works, and they're like, alright, well, prove it. Oh, wow. Go, what? Uh, oh. Well, alright. So only in this room. The way through is through here. Ooh, that's nice. That's some nice smooth Metroid. Yeah! This is what I feel like the game should have looked like. Upside down? Well, I mean, you know, like this. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, camera angle as well. Yeah, like, like, yeah I agree like with Camera that. angles, you know, it, it should have been strictly 2D like this. I think, I think it would have really benefited from that. You could have told your story, told it better, and it would have been fine. Anybody could have played a 2D Metroid. That was the whole point of having it like this. Anyone could figure that out. It was universal. But, and, uh, whoa! Whee! There we go. All right, well, the screw attack has been nerfed because now the gravity's been turned up way, way up. Ooh. Kind of unnaturally so. What's going on here? Yeah, me likey. What? Like, this isn't what normal gravity does. Like, something is doing this. This is about to hurt. Something is happening. We're about to get the gravity suit. Well, well we don't need it. You don't need it right now. I mean, this is this is fine. This is fine. It does seem like you're slowing down a considerable amount. Like you can't even use speed booster in here. The screen is shaking because our, our footsteps are so heavy. <laughs> Dag, dag, who I do up? That's actually awesome. <laughs> Imagine having a presence where you're stomping around this alien base. Oh, it's great. Or Federation base, whatever. Infested it's with. It's a aliens. Federation base made with uh, man-made aliens. Thunk, 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 thunk. <laughs> See the jump is really limited, and so by, result, by uh, extension, your screw attack is too. Did the sound also change? Like, does it sound like you're in a heavy area? It's a little muffled. I like that. Sound design's top notch. This is what it's, I expect from Metroid. It's part of the good things, though. It's part of the good things. Yeah, that's why I like mentioning it whenever possible, so I can shit on it later and not feel bad. And yeah, we can keep some positives up. Yeah, we'll, we'll we, we, we can keep that going. This is this is a neat this is a neat part. I like this. I like this idea. Oh, how the hell? Oh, that's great. That took every ounce of strength that power suit had. Okay. Just a just a wheeler oh, up shit. here. Oh, shit. oh, oh shit. my oh, god! Shit. Okay, that's awesome. Okay. Yeah, this is almost, cool. almost lost it. Oh, this is cool. Good job with them grip fingers there, Samus. <laughs> Good going. All right, now I have to lock on, actually lock on to the, no, not that. That, that thing. That thing, yeah. Wonderful, I love motion controls. It's great. Never gonna age poorly at all. Nope, nope. Yeah. Swag. Okay. Superhero landing. Swag. Uh, better not be like this about the whole thing. 
clunk, 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 clunk. And it's gone. Oh. Just that section. Huh, interesting. So I go over here, and I was like, oh, hey, dang, I hear it's fine. <laughs> all right, all right. Interesting. Picking up what you're putting down. All right, navigation room. Woo! Let's see, this really is just a hodgepodge of Metroid games, isn't it? Put it in a blender. Ah, Sector Zero. All right, Sector Zero is coming up. Yes. That must be the thing that's causing all the gravity to be all wonky. Ooh. All right, let's head up there, and all right, there's the door. Got it. Pretty easy. Kind of forgot what game we were playing. Kind of weird that the camera angle is focusing on that. That's yeah, all right. Yeah, I noticed that too. Can I lock, lock onto it? No. No. I can't do that, though. Whee! I mean, I can Hayabusa jump, so I guess there's no point, but, you know, I, I that's guess... Still, that's for swag. I guess for the option, you yeah. know. That's nice. And then this right here, you can actually still see it. still focusing on the gravity thing. But that's faster. It looks cool. I don't have to go into first-person mode for that. I like and... that better. Speed boost. <laughs> Donk. Shake it off like a champ. It's fine. And now... That, that kind of looks like, uh, you, like you a You can computer. probably shoot that thing. There's some arrows there on your map. Oh, well, what yeah. that's all about. Just tell me where the nav room is, Angel. And... Don't like this. Oh, that's what's causing the gravity spikes. Oh. What the heck is... Wait a minute. <gasps> Whoa! It's Nightmare! Whoa! From Metroid Fusion! Didn't see that one coming! Well! Ooh! Nightmare from Metroid Fusion makes his surprise appearance here in, in Other M as the AI that's causing things to go crazy in Sector Zero! Oh, technically the debut, because this is in the timeline takes before Fusion. Uh oh. I, got, I, I don't know if this is like, you know, their, their, their gravity control that's gone rogue or something like that, but uh, I don't know what this thing is. Oh, that is so cool! Super missiles are the way to go for this one! You, oh, whoa. Best part is I knew what it was, because we've done all the Metroids up to this point, except for Corruption. Oh, that's awesome! Say the best for last, I always say. Yeah, what a reference! Cool. I, I think it's cool. Yeah! Alright, got a high point. Nice, nice. We take those when we can get those. It kind of gives uh, his appearance in Fusion a bit more, a bit more uh, notoriety. Exactly! Like, I actually know what it looked like beforehand. I was worried you wouldn't know what this one is. Like, oh, that's, that's who is that? But you recognize it immediately, so... Oh, time. yeah. You're going. Well, it was it was basically a TV screen with a couple big uh, robotic arms. So, by the way, did you get rid of its gravity ability infinitely? Uh, that thing will melt. Oh, okay, okay. It's basically phase two, and then he, he hit him enough times uh, that breaks, okay. and now we're back to it again. That's a black hole. That's a black hole. Uh oh. <laughs> it's okay, but now he's getting a little getting a little smart. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get over here and come to me now. Uh. But oh. I can dodge like a prince, so oh, over here. Oh, here ew, I hate it. <laughs> oh, that that is not good. <laughs> I am not a fan of that. So what happens if you fall down? Does he like meet you at? Well, if you, you at a different level. If you fall down, the the battle still continues, and it's it's harder to hit him. I don't think you can do any damage until you're on this top level. That's why the grapple points are there. Ooh. So if you get if you uh, get knocked down, and uh, the gravity is on, you got to use those grapple points. Ah, so... That's a little nasty, but we don't have to worry about that because we're good players. Yeah. See, look how good See? You are. <laughs> I thought that was perfect timing on your part. See, we're great gamers. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, that was a good super missile right to the face. The thing is, though, he's got a lot of nut on damage if I hit him in the cheek. I noticed that, too, yeah. I can't, I can't hit him Ooh. in the. I can't hit him on the side. I gotta hit him right in the face, and that's when his face is ready to take damage. Wee! I also noticed he's uh, dealing a lot of damage to you. There is a pattern though. Like this side, not not, not a good time. That's but then he's he's gonna he's gonna do that, and then after he does that, he'll look at you and do a roar. Wah! That'd be the best time to do that because he's gonna both do that. He's saying this ain't looking good for Wah. Eh. Oh, really I, not looking I've good. I've seen you get out of worse. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a good guy. I can do it. I can do it. There wow, we go. what a shot. Great shot. 
then you gotta do like a little bit more. I, I hate the wiggle. I don't like that. It's, it's effective. I don't like the nightmare wiggle. Yeah, one more good super missile ought to do it. I think I gotta get him to his uh yeah, freeze that grav that gravity thing one more time. Do one more little cycle, I guess. Ooh, close. Yeah. I actually saw oh I don't I don't think I can do any damage at all. Oh! Yeah, I don't think I can do any damage at all when the gravity is on. I saw some red, so that's why I thought you were dealing some damage. I got one E-Tank left. Less than one. Uh, yeah. That Fire? Good? That's gotta be- yeah! There we go! Yeah! Nightmare defeated. Yeah! Ah! What the hell? Fuck. Oh, and it, it screams like the fetus from Resident Evil 8. I don't like that. That's why Nightmare Infusion had a green, disgusting face. Ew. Who is the guy who designed that? Yeah, what the hell? Yeah, I'm getting out of here, getting out of here, getting out of here. There's the door, getting out of here, bye. Okay. Right, where were we? <laughs> Just oh. gotta brush that off. Uh-oh. I'm not controlling this. This yeah. is just... Are we moving? Uh oh Are we moving? Uh oh. Why are we moving? Wasn't this ship supposed to be derelict? Well, someone started back up. It must be a mother. Because bottle ship. Well, Metroids. <laughs> Worry about that later. Metroids now. <laughs> Metroids. Just can't wait. Metroids. Punch of Metroids. <laughs> Metroids! <laughs> Metroids! 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 I love Metroids! 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 She better be foaming at the mouth inside that visor. Hope I never find that nightmare guy again. Oh, never. I would hate that. So why did the X know about nightmare? If we're talking fusion. Well, this is. Or, or was it another nightmare? Could be another nightmare. Oh, that's even grosser. I mean, that that, that uh, research station was based on everything that Samus had fought, and they were going to basically weaponize it. It was just the bottle ship part two, except it's the BSL, and it's a lot cooler and better. So wait, they actually used a plot point from Fusion to put a boss in here? That's great! And it actually connects properly. I think the BSL was, like, on the surface. It was supposed to be all, all good and nice. This one... This is specifically a black site. Yeah. Nothing good is coming out of this place. Oh, an abomination inside your TV screen? Eh, it's a typical Tuesday. Oh. Well, here we are. Probably fucking Metroids. Wait for it. Uh, any babies in here need a mum? I think this is where the game's gonna be kind of cinematic, so... Ooh, a that's a... That's a fun angle! Better mess with the walk cycles. Oh, come on, this is a fun angle. Even though it's crap to control, it still looks cool. Ooh! It's chasing me. Oh, let me... Oh, this is great! I'm gonna have to look at something here soon. I'm gonna have to look at something. <laughs> Don't make me look at oh, something! Boy. <laughs> All boy. Alright. Is it, baby? I said something. Let me see where- oh! Oh, I, I knew it! It's- it's- Oh, y yes, it's- 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 it's a bit- yes, if I remember when I first saw the Metroid hatch, I was like that. Oh, this is Metroid 2. You weren't dressed like that, though. You had the gravity suit and everything. If you remember your own continuity! Sorry. But what if you didn't get the gravity suit? No, wait, was you everything- couldn't. Was everything in Metroid 2, you had to get it? I think so. I don't remember. Well, I mean... Maybe she turned mean? it off just to show peace. Alright. This is what's gonna rocket this game right to a six. Fire then. Oh, no! She gets uh -oh. shot in the back once, and her suit falls off. Pardon? What was in that gun? I don't know. Something is disrupting it big time. Disruptor beam. And now her suit has been disabled. Oh, are we going zero suit? 
leaving her utterly defenseless with this with this Metroid here. Free to feed on her now. Oh. We're doomed. We're fucked. Does it remember? Oh, it's hungry. Don't like that. And then, uh, oh, we're saved. By the deleter? Or mother brain? I'm gonna let you react. Mm okay. And we're still going. It's it, wherever the ship is going. Let me react. It's going faster. Let me react. Samus. Yep. Can you hear my voice? No. I read you. I shot you in the back for oh, disobeying orders. Adam. You know what lies up ahead. Metroids! The Metroids and the artificial intelligence that controls them. The fruit of the galactic. I really hope this mother brain project. also has a reptilian body. Yes. So why did you shoot me? I had to disable you. You were getting too powerful. You can't destroy these Metroids. I was just about to. What do you mean? They're too important. Sector Zero Metroids most likely can't be frozen. But you just froze that one. What are you talking about? There's a strong likelihood that the Metroid's mortal weakness, the His friendship to cold, has been overcome through genetic manipulation. Oh. If that's true, there's no way you can destroy them. So they made it an impossible to kill Metroid. Earlier. But you just froze that Metroid! Much. Yeah, you just froze it. You were able to freeze it. I'm glad she pointed that out. True. My guess is that it was because it was still in a larval state. So you're stopping me from going in but there who can say? and killing the Metroids. But why One did you shoot me in the back? They're definitely propagating Metroids. Developing bioweapons with an obvious and fatal flaw would be suicide. Okay. It's hard to imagine the military mass producing defective weapons. But you signed off again, on it. None of this makes sense. Oh, okay, okay you got me there. Their extinction was a wise decision. Yeah, just have that on repeat. None of this makes any sense. Now, since no one has the technology to defeat them, they cannot be allowed to exist. Hang on, Adam. She could have destroyed that Metroid First, no need problem. To know why you're as the creator of the Metroid because she has morph ball bombs, which have destroyed them pretty well in the past. But yeah, why is your name on the Metroid militarization I project? A to write the report from Galactic Federation I was just there that day. In they that put it on report, my desk and I signed they it. Outlined the potential dangers of such a program, and explained categorically why it shouldn't be attempted. Uh -huh. Yeah, I don't buy this for a second. HQ listened. But a small group within the Federation co-opted But this is the ringleaders we're talking about. The uh, small group within the Federation. Okay. No, trust me, mate. Those Chozo didn't know what they were talking about. We'll do Metroids better. Source, trust me, bro. <laughs> Bigger, better, and uncut. We can Sense. do these Metroids proper. You'll be fully recovered soon. Uh-huh. But why did you shoot me? So that, so that she would talk to him. To That's a weird way to get her attention. The, the facility's going right to the to the GFHQ. What Madeline Bergman said is correct. Oh. There's a distinct possibility that this is the start of an attack by MB against the Federation. This uh, mother brain went rogue too. Yep. Some sort I guess it's just what they do. So stop making mother brains. Stop making mother brain. The mother yeah, brain. Stop making Metroids. Just stop. Just stop. Just stop. I've just located a survivor stop. in room MW. Uh, you're having a breakdown. I'm just lost staff. for words. Whoever it is will be a key witness. Can I Secure use my power bombs now? See, it's really hard to enjoy and the game when Ridley. this kind of bullshit is lying underneath it. He's as much of a threat as the Metroids. It's unfortunate that we can't skip the cutscenes. One last word of warning. Yeah, no, you cannot skip the cutscenes. Madeline Bergman. Mother Brain. Is no Mother ally. Brain. She is no ally. Mother Brain. That means that she must be in on it. Maybe she was the, the deleter all along. Oh. And just stole someone's, uh, yeah, GF stole uniform. someone's suit, yeah. 
Hold on, Adam. But what? Samus, of Why course, is not going to let Adam do the sacrifice play. That's her job. Why did you shoot me? Zero. Was it literally just to get my clothes off? Leave it to me. Dad, no. I have a I'll feeling that place. was the case. <laughs> they don't, I don't think they know how to <laughs> animate that scene very well. Which is, it's like, like why she's so stiff and not, and not moving so much. Hey, zero hey, has that's, a, that's, that's a good explanation as any, I'd say. I would say so too, yeah. We just wanted to see her in the zero suit again. And you see how she moves in dread? God, I could just, I could just, you know, I, I could date the cutscenes in dread. They're so good looking. It's so stylish and so on, and so chic and on point. Don't you dare, Adam. Let me go in. I'm the only one who has a shot against the Metroids. Literally. We have to take the chance. I can kill Metroids. Please, I've done Adam. it before. But I made them extinct. Power bomb! Power bomb! One power me. bomb Just takes up the whole chance. thing. Let's do it. Do they really? Probably. I, wish oh, I wouldn't feel good. I might have to test that over in Super Metroid. I love you. Unlike you, I'm no galactic savior. Oh, now you have you. a conscience? Oh, now you're recognizing her abilities? But I can save you. What? You should be completely healed soon. There isn't much time. Before what? You sacrifice yourself? On our missions. I'm sorry for getting a little rough with you. Why did you shoot me? <laughs> Still trying to figure that part out, yeah. <laughs> he aims a gun at himself. It's better than going to fight Metroids. Oh, this damn defective Chozo suit that's been made by smart bird people from thousands of years ago. It just can't seem to work when it needs Wait. to work. Adam. Thank God the Galactic Federation always fucking works. Why do they do this angle? They are doing, like, the sci-fi. No! This is every bad sci-fi movie. It is! Movie. No objections. Right, lady? What? But this is stupid. That shouldn't be your catchphrase, bro. Oh, it is, and now she's got to do her little catchphrase where she's like, any objections? Well, actually, it would kind of be awesome if she just authorized power bombs right here, right now, blew the door open, and threw him backwards. Ah, oh, come on! Down! <laughs> Hey, I got another finger I can hold up. <laughs> now, as long as you put it downward. It's my point. It's my pointer finger. It's like, you listen here. Uh, yeah. First off, this is not how you write a character. Pointer finger, down position. Number one. It's either first or third, not both. <laughs> Second. <laughs> Emergency. Is Emergency is sector zero. Eject the whole thing. Well, we had Metroids and now they're gone. There go the Metroids! So the what? Bye -bye. They're just floating in space? Oh no. Worse than that. Oh, they're going towards the Federation. He said that whenever <gasps> whenever there's a, dis a contingency, oh. that there's there's too much damage, this thing gets launched and explodes. And that's what Samus was gonna go do. She was gonna go and kill oh. them and destroy the Metroids, probably cause some damage, and she would got she would have gotten blown the hell up. Oh, she would have got jettis uh exploded, yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, Adam vanished. That's one way to get rid of a character. My best friend. And now a, uh, a, a short eulogy best. for Adam Malkovich, the, the dumbest military genius the world I ever knew. Had. He didn't fucking do anything. He sat in the room and gave barked orders. There is a tab under uh, Adam Malkovich's wiki in the Metroid Wiki that uh, has uh, allegations of incompetence. <laughs> This mission proves that he is not a good leader at all. Really? Oh, I mean, Wait, dividing your people, <laughs> knowing I mean, Samus is the most powerful of them it's all, and, and de delegating and her then to getting basically getting hurt by the fact that she's the strongest. Yeah. Adam granted me Holy that shit! I have a and the fact that that, uh, that whole Metroid thing, where instead of you know saying hey or don't shoot or it's inv it's invulnerable no or letting her find out on her own, <laughs> she shoots he shoots her in the back. Weakening her and exposing her to the Metroid, and she thanks him he for it. Me. Oh yeah! But he did the right thing. He did a sacrifice play. The Metroids are gone. Now we need to basically clean up everything else here. Otherwise, things are gonna get messy later on. So fine. We didn't, fine. We didn't get fine. to fight a single Metroid. We gotta get the hell out of here. That's for sure. Oh wait, it's blowing up. It's blowing up. Oh okay. Oh, it's more than blowing up. It's like oh yeah. Uber blowing up. That's bad. That's very bad. Okay. Let's, let's not have that happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's, let's get out of here. Yeah. Let's, let's go double yeah. time. Double, triple let's, time. Yeah, yeah. Double, triple time. Let's yeah, get yeah, going. Yeah. Let's, Can't let's really let's do get the speed. Oh, that's really not going. Oh, 
Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh god. Oh no. We all right. You gotta, gotta shine spark. Shine spark. Shine spark. Why is the speed boost not working? Speed boost. Speed boost. No. Yeah. Oh no. Well, that's a game over. I guess I'll just reload save. Grapple and beam. Turn on my gravity suit. Oh, of course. Again, it's a, it's a gravity function, not a suit. Samus keeps the exact same suit for the whole game! Why?! Okay, that's bitchin'. I love the glow on that. At least you get a cool glow, though, and now they're all just getting flung oh, out. Yeah. Okay, this is pretty awesome! Just excuse me, I got places to be, I got things to do. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is actually really yeah. cool! Ooh, nice slowdown, Wii. Gotta love it. Oh, it's, please it's give me another. whatever it can give to give us a set piece. Ah! It's trying its damnedest, <laughs> and Indiana Jones did. Oh, that was pretty neat. <sighs> well, I don't know why she didn't think of this, you know, when the gravity wells were around there, but, you know. <laughs> well, you, you heard Adam. As his final command, he gave us some things to do. Basically, fix all the shit in this place. So that's what we're going to do next time on Metroid Other M. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and give Met uh, Samus a bit of a uh, character moment and have her kind of sob in the corner over the over her fallen comrade and just kind of just you know. <laughs> what a train wreck we'll see you next time <laughs>